Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. In our last video, we did work on a main mission with Dutch, and it went it went sideways, as usual. <laughs> but in today's video, I do want to work on a side quest, and that side quest is going to be all the way down here in the Braithwaite Manor to help Penelope Braithwaite in her course for true love. So follow up on Penelope's letter and help her and Bo escape. So I am going to do that. I'm... I think I'm actually going to take the long route to get down there just because there's some exploration that I could do potentially along the way and and potentially bring you back in should exciting things happen. Well, I found things already. <laughs> A legendary fish over here, which I'm probably not going to do. But more importantly, I found... A, a rock carving all the way up there. I don't know how I'm supposed to collect that, though. But that is, be oh, I can inspect it here. Wow, that is beautiful. Unbelievably beautiful. I mean, I gotta say, I have, I have been very impressed with all the rock carvings that I found so far, and apparently I only have three more to go. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Let me go, you sick, fit son of a bitch! You brought this on yourself, shut it. Uh, no, let's, uh... This is a... We'll save the girl! Rescue the girl! <laughs> oh no! Um... Calm down, ma'am. It's okay. Calm down, ma'am. You're okay. I can't keep sniffing this thing's ass. Come on! I'm coming, lady. Calm. Remove the stranger, Get me Morgan. Get these damn shackles. Uh, let's drop her. I don't mean no breacher. Quit this doorman. Cut free. Oh gosh, I hope she's not a horrible person. Took your damn time. Ugh, rotten pig fucker. Never did no right by me. Not since I was six. Well, glad you're feeling so good about all this. Hey, he brought this on his damn self. Where my fault this brain got out about damn demons. Oh, demons. Well, uh... You have a good day there now, ma'am. You're welcome. Goddamn hillbillies. <laughs> right? <laughs> this place is crazy. Well, this is weird. It's I'm I'm right here. <laughs> I made my way to the little dot. And apparently the little dot is just a chimney. Oh, we'll pick the wild carrot for, for Wednesday. She likes her carrots. Is there anything in the in the chimney? Maybe. Search the chimney. Jewelry. Let's search some more. <laughs> where is where is the house? Oh, a gold nugget. That's nice. Where is the house? There should be more carrots here, right? No, no. I thought these were all carrots. Oh, maybe they're over here. Here we go. Here's the carrots. Uh, yeah, that's, um... I'm, I'm just gonna say that's weird to have a chimney and nothing else. Help me! Help you? The pox? The pox? Uh... Hello? Ooh. You can rest now, Hello, sir. <laughs> I am well. Check the tent. I I doesn't make me feel good when Wednesday moves away. Hands up. 
You trying to rob a sick man? I was trying to help. Uh, bullshit you was. I hope you move fancy boots. Unlike you, I was on them. Really? Yeah. Was not very nice at all. I should get to rob you now. Because you were trying to rob... Oh, Murphy Brood. I'm totally robbing you guys. You're very... Very... You're very not nice. Because <laughs> I'm five, apparently. Um... Is that about it? Anything else? I know, Wednesday. You were probably right. I'll, I'll take the gin and your coffee. I don't know what else you've got there that I can't pick up. It's probably fine. Um, ooh, big thunderstorms again! Oh, I love it. I love it when I get to ride my horse through thunderstorms. Okay, well, that that just happened. Hey, it's Rock and Sam! Rock and Sam! Hey! Hey! You the morning raiders! Move on through, Ain't boy! You. Oh, no, we gotta stop you guys. Cargo here. What cargo y'all trying to stop? And you there, too. Done for now. Oh, shit. Shit. Dead man walking. And you're there, dead, too. Damn it all. Guess they got what was coming to them. Yes, Lemoyne Raiders. We get to shoot and not feel bad about. You're welcome. I should have some good cowboy karma, right? Okay, yep. well, I'm finally here, back at the Braithwaite's. I, I am slightly concerned that there's some still left alive and they're going to shoot me, but we're, we're about to find that out. I'm going to not go down the main path in the hopes to avoid people. Plus, she's over by the water anyway, right? to be any people about. My my in-game Siri does not like them <laughs> and I'm not following the road. But yeah, I did make my way all the way down here, obviously. Um, I discovered, let's see. Um, I did discover a few new things. Nothing super exciting. Oh yes, um, Fort Bernard and Mossy Flats I'd already found. There's a little bit here I gotta clear up. Here on Glen, Butcher's Creek. Nope, that wasn't new. Oh, I left you here. Um, Central Union Railroad. That's what I found. Uh, Klingman. I found a house and uh, a man who was shooting at me and I shot back and, and the game did not like that. That was bad cowboy karma. There's still a little bit of pieces that I did miss that I have to go back for, but uh, I expect I'll probably do an exploration video at some point. Try to compile it all in the future, but nothing else really happened that I didn't already include in today's video. Where might she be? Okay. Oh, yeah. oh, the sad, sad lady who's still trapped, but I don't know how to, to rescue. There's a person over there, but they're not showing up as red. Maybe enough time has passed. I think I see Penelope. All right, let's go. Hi, Penelope. We're gonna slow walk our way up here. Oh, oh you came. I did you come. You came, you finally came. I came. Oh, thank you, thank you, you lovely, lovely man. Uh, calm down, miss. Oh, come on, let's go. We ain't got a minute to lose. They killed her. Ooh. They killed Miss Calhoun. All she wanted was a better lot for women, and they killed her, those pigs. Who what? killed her? I don't know. My cousins, probably, or, or bows. Well, you met them. They are animals. Not even animals. Monsters. Monsters, if God had lost all his powers of imagination. Can you... Can you please take me to the train station? Bo will be waiting. Bo, why couldn't he come and rescue you? Yeah. Well, if they saw me and him together, they'd lynch him and send me off to a nunnery. Or maybe they'd lynch us both, I ain't quite sure. They do so love hanging folk. Where are you heading? Up to Boston. Good. 
Yeah, I like you up there. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Of course. Oh, to Rhodes. Really? That's it? I thought you would have wanted to go farther away, like Saint Denis or something. I'm in your hands. Just get me to Rhodes Railway Station. Okay. Let's try and get you a train. The Bo's just waiting at the station in the hope you'll show up. Or I'll show up to help you show up. <laughs> he goes to there every day he can. Makes up some excuse or other. I said he would see me there one day soon, and today he will. God willing. Well, well. If he's there, that's true love, all right. No. <laughs> I've hardly seen him since the rally. They watched me so carefully, and he's waited, or so his letters say. Our families won't let us out. And then all that business with Aunt Catherine and my cousins. You saw the house. Yeah. And then Lee Gray and those boys killed. So much bloodshed. I, you'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Yeah. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something yeah. good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That'd be great. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and I. <laughs> He's like, yeah, that's totally what I've been hoping. Like, oh. Dutch Vanderlyn gang comes in and, and just makes everything worse. This is why I'm concerned about the Wapiti tribe, that Dutch is going to get his hands on on them, them being the son in particular, and just make everything worse. But have to be better. Let's focus Our on happy endings for today. years and years. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and pain and ruination behind us. Plenty before you have. Plenty will again. But, yeah, as far as it goes... Get out. Don't look back. Make something decent of your life. Exactly. He's a good man, isn't he? Bo. There are worse. <laughs> Definitely. He's kind and he's caring and he's strong. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to laugh. <laughs> he, he's a lot of things, but. <laughs> and not strong like you, but strong enough to stand up to his family. Kind of. To be different from folk. You don't know how hard that can be to say something is wrong when everyone around you thinks it's right. No, perhaps I don't. Well, he is a good man. And he's lucky. You're both lucky to have each other. This could be the best day of my life or the worst. I can't bear not knowing which. Hold on. It'll be clear soon enough. Oh, gosh, I hope it's the best day of your life. I, I really, really do. Is. Oh, it's him. Will you ride on the train with us a little, just to the first stop? Fine. Sure. I apparently I'm armed to the teeth, so let's 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 go. Hi, Bo. I brought your lady love. You came. You came. At last, you came. Oh. Oh, my sweet. My best of men. <laughs> oh, I'm hardly a man at all. But I love you, Penelope Braithwaite. Oh, sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, some of them jewels would do just fine. <laughs> Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets, dear Mr. Morgan? We, we can't chance being seen. Sure. Thank you. We'll meet you on the platform. Okay, I'm I'm good friends with Alden here. Hello, Alden. Maybe Alden. Alden, I buy some tickets. Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Of course. Oh, hello, sir. Hi. Hello, Alden. I hope all is well. Uh, not terribly. But good to see you. Oh no. Excuse me, Alden. Get off me! Shut the mouth and watch that door! Get on the train. Get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fool. And a punch in back here without giving you a whip. We should have done this last time. Get on the train, Paul. Go to your wall. Four fists and maybe one brain between you. You'll go to get hurt, cowboy. Uh, 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 oh, get no. Him, oh no! Oh no! You boys should stick to this. 
And beat, and beat, and beat. Ah. If that is his real name, I can't. It doesn't matter. He can't ah. fight. Oh, uh. Arthur, come on! Uh, I'm trying. Uh, okay. I know, Alden. I'm trying to. I'm trying to sort out. Quick, come on! Oh, Please, pick up the. Get on. I'm getting on. Enter train. Woohoo! We made it. Hello, future. <sighs> all right, all done. That is quite a family you got there, sir. No kidding. I know. <laughs> Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half brother as a slave. So, what, what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used oh, to say gosh. things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity, and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. Mm. There's good people in this county, but our families bullied them and drove most of them off. Whites as well as blacks, all over this silly feud. Yeah, well, how to life. Oh, my lord. What? <gasps> Seriously? Well, he's my second cousin. What is with it with all these goddamn cousins? I think they found out about the jewels. All right, keep your heads down. I'll deal with this. Jewels? I knew you had some damn juice. Okay. They're coming from over the hill. You must have all the jewels in the state. The amount of your cousins is here. What the hell's going on? Uh, where am I getting shot? Okay, hang on. I'm 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 not awake enough today to do this without. Good look up front. What will Drive you do? train. I'll figure it out. I'm driving a choo choo train. Headed towards Sandini? We are headed toward no, we're headed back towards Rig Station. That's very much not towards Sandini. And who's this guy? Is this guy over here attacking my Wednesday? Or is our, my horse just being my horse is just injured, maybe? I don't know. We're driving a 
It's best you go on alone from here. Mr. Arthur, I didn't know you could drive a train. Neither did I. <laughs> but if I'm honest, it was kind of fun. It was so much fun. And I didn't kill any of us. Well, I killed some of your relatives, but they would have killed all of us. Yes. You are a gentleman, sir. Oh, no, I ain't. Yes, you are. Here, I ain't got much money, but these sapphires are worth a lot of money. Old family heirloom. That Braithwaite treasure. No, I'm gonna reject. We have enough money. I couldn't take it. No. Let's get you off to Boston before any more your relatives show up. That might be wise. Hey, you there. Yeah? This couple is heading up north to the Boston line. They got money, they'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Hey, um... You carry protection on a journey like this? I wouldn't be much of a stage driver if I didn't. It goes everywhere I do. Hey! Oh. Miss Braithwaite is going to hold on to this until arrival. Hmm? Okay. On account of the treasure on your person. I don't know how to thank you. Uh -huh. You're a fine man, sir. Just get out of here. I'll leave. Yeah! Hi. Good cowboy karma. Mission complete. The course of true love part five. Oh. Arthur tries to help Penelope Braithwaite and Bo Gray escape their families. But I, I feel like I had five headshots. I'm I well, I don't want to say I'm never gonna complete them within time, because I did in the last video. And I have unopened mail items. We should go in and get those. Where if you oh. wouldn't mind coughing in your sleeve, sir, I really I'm can't sorry. afford to get sick again this month. Howdy. Hi, I'm here to hit receive my mail. A letter from the mayor's office. I wonder what that's about. Okay, letter from the mayor's office. June 1899 from the office of Jean-Marc Mercier, mayor of Saint-Denis. Dear Mr. Kilger, these are troubling times at City Hall with the resignation of Mayor Lemieux, but civic business continues. The new mayor has asked that you be formally commended for your recent services to the city of Saint Denis. Please accept this token of gratitude of the citizenry, see along with folks seem to be running from their problems. I see it every day. Along with a personal message from the mayor, this scandal will pass. And we will be stronger than ever. Yours respectfully, the office of the mayor of Saint Denis. Oh. Well, I wonder what else we got. Nothing. I didn't, I didn't get anything else. This is all my recent stuff. 
Okay, well, um, These? I do wonder, what's, what is this? Arthur's saddle. <gasps> Did Wednesday die? <gasps> Wednesday! Wednesday! Wednesday died! Oh no, Wednesday! Oh, Wednesday. I thought I could... Don't I have a horse reviver? Don't I... Isn't that a thing that I actually own? Oh, Wednesday died. Did I hit Wednesday with the train? Is that what happened? I feel like that's what must have happened. Put away. Yes. Put away. Oh, I'm so sad. Remove saddle. Oh, Wednesday, you were such a good horse. Okay, well, I am in strawberry now. And yes, he I have a new horse. Through the eye of a camel. And no mistake. Hello, sir. I'm burning with passion. With a great and holy passion. Really? That shall light up the world and make it great once more. Okay. Life is glorious. Behold and see. Hey, mister. Hello again. Hi. Uh, ready for salvation? Remember, it's follow me, and together we will find paradise and eternity. Well, I think maybe I'm looking for a different salvation than that. Well, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> no, but I'll try my luck elsewhere. If you know what I mean. Good luck. Okay, well, what I was trying to say is when Wednesday's gone. She is gone. There is no reviving of her at all. So now I have a new horse, which is a thoroughbred because they seem to be more manageable. Rejoice and, and, and his name to find great is salvation. still not Wednesday. Because I miss my Wednesday. But I was so close to Strawberry, because I, I bought my new horse over here. I was so close to Strawberry, I figured, hey, why not go and do a stagecoach robbery you while okay, we're here? My, my, she's, well, he's very fidgety. Dressed like that. Hey, thank you. I feel like I look pretty snazzy. Hey there, come on over. I got something here that might be of interest. Okay, thanks, Hector. What you got for me this time, Hector? Coach heading to Appleseed Timber. Supposed to be a lot of guns. Really? Might want to catch them off guard. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's inspect. Well. Appleseed Timber Coach Tip. Railway Bridge North of Appleseed Timber Compa Company Coach. Coming west, headed for Appleseed, carrying wages, Mark. cash. Should be in the back. Expect a couple of guards. I still can't as believe as Wednesday's public, I'm on duty. dead. She's gone. Come on. Boy. Oh, I should go to the butcher here and sell this pelt because apparently I ran into a bear on the way here, and it it's still not Wednesday was oh, a little freaked you out. Look hungry. No, but I'm gonna sell you my poor black pelt just to get it off of my my horse. Thank you for your cup. Let's go, boy. Mary, I can't believe Wednesday died. It's like, what happened? I don't understand. Okay, well, I'm going to head. Hello, sir. Hello, head over to this robbery, and I was doing, I was doing so good today. I was saving people, and they were gonna have a happy ending, and then sa Wednesday was sacrificed for all of that. You know, it, it's we're. I'm gonna attempt to move on. Even though I won't move on, because it's still not Wednesday. All right, the coach is coming. And I'm ready for it. Yeah, him in the face.
Oh, oh, hi! Shot off his hat. I have that habit. Okay, break lock. Break lock. And let's take the money pile. Coach robbery's completed. 100 bucks. Hey, still not Wednesday. I about paid you off. What about paid off what okay, I, I spent to, to purchase you, boy? Oh, I miss Wednesday. Their black pretty coat yeah. and everything, but all right, well, that coach robbery is taken care of. I, I don't know if there's going to be any more. I guess eventually I'll check in with um, Alden and I forget the guy's name is Strawberry, but we'll do that. I do want to head back to San Denis. One of you recommended that I do the side quest that's here sooner rather than later, and um, I, I'd say we do it sooner. However, though, I just want to move over here out of the way because I okay. think... What I'm going to do right now is actually read some articles from my latest newspaper, which is San Denis Times number 50. And then we'll go back to San Denis tomorrow. O'Driscoll captured, tensions high, Blackwater athletics team missing, friends fear they have been foully dealt with. Members of the Blackwater athletics club are still missing and their friends and family are excited by the gravest fears. Excited? Really? That's the word we're using? Okay. They were last seen leaving the north edge of town for a group athletics run. And although the most thorough search has been made for them, they cannot be found. Certain facts around their disappearance have given cause for suspicion. The affair has created a sensation in Blackwater and the surrounding community. They had departed on a run and had intended to return the same evening. Their friends are making a diligent search and police in the neighborhood, neighboring areas have been notified. At first, there were rumors they had been kidnapped by Indians. However, this appears to be false as no tribes have engaged in theft of livestock or kidnapping in some years. The Blackwater Athletics team were training for a competitive meet next month and were expected to take top honors in fencing, wrestling, and baseball. That seems really random. Okay, Pinkertons find missing man. Originally believed to be murdered, officials pra praise the agency. The Pinkerton National Detective Agency has concluded a thorough investigation into the case of a merchant who went missing last month. Conditions at the time of his disappearance led immediately to the theory of murder. However, Pinkerton agents studying his accounts made some startling discoveries. John O'Neill, one of the most popular and wildly known merchants in San Louis, disappeared without a trace last month. Initially thought to have been murdered, certain facts tied to his disappearance have given cause for suspicion. Officials hired the Pinkerton agency to investigate. The agents report that Mr. O'Neill was short in his accounts. Though, through his shop, Mr. O'Neill handled large sums of money and, according to his friends, fulfilled his trust honorably. After it was disclosed that he was up to $5,000 short on his accounts and had taken to paying playing cards regularly, the suspicion of his friends was that he had taken his own life. After a thorough search of the hills and surrounding countryside, O'Neill was found in a ravine, half mad and wishing to die, saying he had brought shame on his name and family. Officials and family members praised the agency for solving the mystery and finding O'Neill, who was recuperating from his injuries and exposure. Founded in the 1850s, the Pinkerton Agency has been instrumental in solving several disturbances, including labor disputes, and was even known to have foiled an assassination plot on the president. Okay, one more. Love letter to Wall Street. $25 million in tax dollars given. Public is indignant. Wall Street banks are expressing worry that the public is displaying misplaced outrage and indignation over the pouring of $25 million in tax dollars into the stock exchange to protect asset values. They say it is needed because of the inelastic rules of the national banking system. However, many say that is a gross misrepresentation of the facts. Wall Street has been fighting against government regulation for many years now. Senior bankers argue the claim that the only way the system can work is for them to get handouts of tax dollars is a ludicrous assertion. 
and that the system works as intended. Well, then why did you get the money? I, I would like some explanation, please. But anyway, I'm going to pause things here today. And like I said, tomorrow I will probably meet you in San Denis because I want to work on the side quest that is there. And then maybe also head back up to... What is it, Ainsburg, and work on our noblest of men and women, the quest I've had since so early in the game. I would like to cross that one off as complete as well, but we'll see how everything goes and as usual, we'll go from there. <laughs> but as always, thank you so very much for watching. Please do keep yourselves safe ah, and sorry, I will see you boy. again tomorrow with another new Red Dead Redemption 2 video.